In this video, I'm going to show you how to add your Twitch chat to OBS Studio. Now, this is actually really easy to do. We just need to open up an internet browser, then type in Streamlabs and press enter. You then need to click on this top website, streamlabs.com, and then you'll need to go and sign up for an account. I'm just going to press login as I already have an account. And basically, when you create an account in Streamlabs, you need to link it to your Twitch account as well. So I'm going to select login with Twitch and then just scroll down and click on authorize. Now, once you're in Streamlabs, if you scroll over to the left-hand side, you'll see this option for chat box. Go and click on this. And then what you need to do is go and set up how you want your chat displayed. So there's a bunch of different customization options here. You could decide how you want the chat laid out. You can also go and censor or blacklist bad words. You can add a chat delay as well. So you just need to go through all of these steps to customize this to how you want it. And then what you need to do is select the click to copy widget URL button and then just press copy. Now do bear in mind that this is a sensitive URL, so make sure not to share this with anyone else. Now once you've copied this URL, you can open up OBS Studio on your computer. Now down by where it says sources, click on the plus icon, click on browser, and then just call this something like chat, and then we can press OK. Now what you need to do is go and get rid of all of this text in the URL, and this is where you need to go and paste in your own custom URL. So once you've pasted this in, we can go and press OK. So now in our OBS preview, you can see we now have this random box and this is our chat box so now all you need to do is go and place this exactly where you want on the screen it looks empty at the moment but you can always head over to your twitch stream and you can try typing something into the chat and it will appear in this window here so it's really as simple as that guys let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful